What is up you guys, welcome back to another Rush Racing 2 video. Well, if you're trying to get content for Rush Racing 2, I could have named myself as the best option for you. But now, unfortunately, as you can see from my channel, I haven't been uploading anything. And with that being said, I haven't been playing Rush Racing 2 too. Uh, the main reason I stopped wasn't really because the game is doing bad, because th that's the thing the game is doing really really bad but that wasn't the first thing that made me stop uh, the reason I stopped is because I saw people are playing from PC and I found a way to play from PC and I started playing from goddamn PC and that meant that I could get really consistent times and play with smooth nice frames per second because if I really gonna play from this device I'm playing right now from Android uh, the best reaction time I can do uh, is 0 0.040 if not more and you know even the shift don't make really sense like in some cars like the c6r you might be shifting perfectly you might be getting an awful run a 7.1 as you could see from my other videos a 7.3 one day i got against an r8 Le Mans, and i'm like what are you talking about how that even happened so let's let's forget about that let's forget about the whole thing the thing was that my computer kind of died like one one or two months ago and uh, i took it to the store i bought it from and i had a warranty to you know uh, fix the computer they send it to the manufacturer being a couple cities away uh, asus Z zr greece whatever and uh, since then they are waiting on the battery replacement because of the coronavirus thing and you know they they keep telling me that there are a lot of countries on lockdown even though i i can't really understand which countries are in lockdown and that, that's a battery man like honestly it's not a screen it's not a it's not something uh, specific of a specific specific kind of a thing it's a goddamn battery it's not something that I mean, fix it, man. You told me two weeks and I'm here waiting almost two months and you couldn't even know what uh, I use my uh, laptop for. Uh, obviously, I wasn't really... Uh, they, they never told me that I might lose my info, so I really guess that if there would be a chance of me losing information and data from my device, they would let me know. They would say something, you know, we don't take responsibility for uh, any kind of... I don't know they would say something am I right am I wrong I don't know they never told me that it will take so much time so I, I can't really trust them so that's not the case we already made the video three minutes for nothing big talk whatever just a quick info about me a quick update and going back to what we are doing today now it's Saturday it's out of context uh, not a Monday update nothing it's just a video that I sat down and said you know I haven't talked to my fans for a while I know you guys are waiting for me on my news some of you hit me up on Facebook Instagram everywhere uh, to talk with me and see what's going on ask about the game uh, but you know I thought it would be an overall good decision to make a video now like the previous video I'm selling my stuff and I've already sold nine cars I could honestly sell way many cars because people are asking to buy there is a lot of it's a good community actually for buying and selling and there are good deals to be made but i'm not selling cheap unfortunately now with that being said uh, i try to sell the cars with my name you know you're buying an nsgs car you you right now that you're listening you might not give a God damn fuck actually about that, you might not care, but there are people that if they will say, oh, that's NSGS Lamborghini Huracan, that, that, that's his car, it's a fully gemmed, on parts, uh, most expensive paint in the game, 250 gems, uh, gem rims, everything gemmed, fully gemmed, so... You know, why not buy it a bit more expensive? Now, it's fully stock and the price I'm trying to get is 27 to 25 bucks. You know, we can negotiate a little bit and see how the things are going to be. And before we do any deals, we had a small issue in the previous deal I made. Like, I sold for, I had 100 cars and I sold 9. 9 or no? I, I gave a couple away. I sold 7 cars and made one, 210 dollars. That's how much money I made from only seven cars overall um, I'm selling for reasonable prices in the same time I know that the, they will go they will rise again the prices are not going to be 
to stay so low because of the cheaters once the cheaters will be out the prices will go up again so if you really think that uh, the game won't shut down because that's the only thing that currently keeps me away from not selling but buying cars because the market is crazy cheap you can get 177 max for 10 12 13 bucks and i'm selling mine stock my stock 177 for 13 bucks i'm doing that i'm going against the market and i'm being a bad seller and it's just one of the greatest sellers of all time man honestly you could you could buy anything from me in racing rivals anything you ask you would have it not only because i was a good player and i had a good garage but because i had the greek players behind me to you know this guy is searching for this car can we find it yeah of course one of those billion greek players that been playing had the car and they would sell it for a reasonable price but now as a great seller i'm going against the market completely because if you are buying cheap that means you're buying from a cheater no matter how legit he is no matter how great you know him I, I don't really care if i can believe that the most legit player is a hard care overall how makes a new igm plays then somehow wins the hacker you know if you even ask for proof they might do that you know he fouled you know cheaters foul they foul what well, cheaters are not cheaters there is no bot exactly yet it's just like an auto run so if you get a little bit of a buggy device you can foul you can spin you can early shift all the shifts and you know you can even lose because of the bot there are many things guys that uh, are confusing in the whole uh, in the whole this scenario now back to selling if you're interesting for any car i won't come and say hey cheap cars come take them and then sell it for super expensive the truth is that for the current market my prices are high but for the honest overall market my prices are lower than anyone else so currently i'm not in a good position to sell but ha, there you go i got already 200 bucks from selling because some people know how the right market works so i'm not advertising my stuff there are people that are legit and sell for cheaper that's true too not only hackers are the good sellers uh there are some people that are quitting because i'm not quitting let's be honest Th that question has been made a billion times to me guys no this is not quitting this is just taking a breath and seeing that collections don't really matter because yeah, I made the best garage in uh, Rush Racing 2. I managed to make one of the best garages. I managed to get every single car wrapped, unwrapped, everything. I have all the wrapped beasts from the beginning of the game. We start from the Eclipse, we go to the Sylvia. After the Sylvia, we had the Subaru. After the Subaru, we had the Bentley. Where is my Bentley? Where is my Bentley? There it is. After the Bentley, we had what? We had the Z4, that, uh, the Z4 is self-claimed as well, completely self-claimed. It was the second top 10 we actually got as a team. And then, then, then every car, we got the R8, blah, 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 blah. And then we kept on going. So, uh, yeah, eight minute to nine minute video. Overall saying nothing but selling advertisement. Yeah, that's a video you're not really interested for guys But unfortunately the game doesn't really offer anything else to make on it Like I honestly can't do anything. I can't play because I don't have a device and even if I would have a device I wouldn't be able to win anyone but a couple of unlucky players because the other ones would be all cheaters and you know, at the end of the day, there are some really competitive players outside too. So I can't say that I will beat any, like every legit player outside. That's the, that's the truth. I will lose to legit players as well. I'm a human. I foul. I spin. Uh, I wasn't like back in the racing rivals day. There was Frank Martinez to be my greatest rival because he was the only guy consistent like me. Nobody else could beat me besides this guy. And uh, so here, I guess there will be someone that will manage to take couple cars from me obviously not speaking about the first rush racing two players you know like the guys that have acted cool and talked a lot of shit because i smoked them plenty times so whatever wish you're enjoying your day wish you're enjoying everything even though we have we are in hard times that that's the truth 
for everyone, for every country, not only because of the coronavirus, but that's the thing that affects all of us, obviously. Uh, so yeah, stay safe, stay home, and uh, I guess it's the first time that I will advise you to not go outside and spend your money to an online game. I actually, it makes sense. I'm selling my cars for you guys to not be bored at home. So come by, take them, play, enjoy. Love, peace, and GS, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.